Hi guys, welcome to this chords lesson, which is for Super Freak by Rick James. I'm gonna teach you how to play the entire song right here, right now. It's not that hard to play. I'm gonna teach you that little melody line as well as the main chords. So if you wanna learn how to play this song, as well as Can't Touch This, because it's actually the same notes, keep on watching. For now, here we go. Okay, so I want you to have a look above the piano for the chords. We've got D, A minor, G, and A minor. And if you don't know what that means, that's absolutely fine. I'm gonna teach you all you have to know right now. So just sit tight. But I wanna have a look at the left hand first. You're gonna play an octave, which simply means that you play the same note twice. Okay, so a D right here and a D right here will make a D octave. By the way, if you're having trouble to play these octaves, I made a lesson on how to play octaves. And if you're still having trouble after that, you can also play a single note, okay? That's fine. But I kind of like to play the octave. So, D octave. Now, what are the other octaves that we have to play? Let's have a look above the piano. We had D already, and then we have A, G, and A. So the octaves are gonna be D, A, G, A. So like this. And again, if you're having trouble, you can play single notes. Du, 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 du. Okay, you can play it here just as well. If you find that too low, you can play it right here, okay? But now we have to play something with that right hand as well. We're going to be playing F sharp A and D for the D octave, followed by E, A and C for A minor, and then D, G, B for G, and E, A, C, okay? So again, F sharp A D, E A C, D G B, and E A C. Now, why do I teach you these chords? Because if you actually want to play this song, maybe sing to it or play in it in a band, um, you don't want to play that little the thing that we're going to get in a bit. You don't want to play that all the time, okay? Maybe you just want to switch it up a little bit, so then you can just. Play the chords and have that as a little bit of a backing sound, okay? So again, chords F sharp A D, E A C, D G B, and E A C. Now let's combine it. There we go. So you can just play these chords once. Or you can say, you know what, I'm actually gonna repeat some of them. So And that's always going to be that A minor chord, okay? So that will sound like this. Pretty cool. Now the little melody is so easy, it's just eight notes. D, C, B, A. Which is easy. And now E, G, B, A. So what you can do now is combine that with left, and you have to combine it like this. So it's just that first note that's together, right, right, and then right here. So there's a little delay in the first one. You can, of course, play an octave in the left hand. Like that. Or you can play an octave in the right hand as well. Just like that. And then switch back to the chords. You can even do something crazy like playing it in the left hand. Okay, octaves. Doesn't really matter, okay? You can do whatever you want, but now you know how to play Super Freak as well as Can't Touches. 